Uh, nice to see you, everyone, here. And first of all, I want to explain about Tandem MOOC and how we did here uh, this project with Open University of Catalonia. Uh, basically, what does it mean? That, that project, the project is let's learn, let's practice, let's have fun with practicing uh, native languages. Okay. Then, first of all, uh, she used, uh, should, should be here with me, Christine Appel, but she can make it. Uh, but I, I introduce herself. She's a senior lecturer in the uh, Center of Modern Languages of Catalonia, on Open University of Catalonia. Open University of Catalonia is full uh, online university here on Catalonia, and it the, was the first for online with more than 6,000 students currently, and they are growing up. Okay, uh, they create their own LMS at the beginning, and we help them also to integrate Moodle inside uh, their own LMS. And Christine Appel, uh, she is very focused on the practice of learning languages, and she helped us to create a suite of tools named Speak Apps that allows the students and the users to improve their skills in languages. Then I present myself. I'm Antoni Bertan, city of Trezipun. Uh, also, I am European LTI co-chair. This is uh, one octet uh, named before uh, IMS. Uh, the typical thing in Moodle when you go to the activities sector and external tool, this is LTI. And we are working together to uh, do standard things, to connect things. And for tomorrow, I have a presentation about that. And here are my details. And let's go review Tandem MOOC. Tandem MOOC, what is more or less? Tandem MOOC uh, allows the students to improve the opportunities to practice languages, English and Spanish in this case, this edition. We have different editions and we can do with different languages. Also, um, the, the learning principle that, uh, um, that is behind the Tandem MOOC is practice with native. Not only I am alone or I have a teacher, no. I have uh, some, some people that more or less is like me, has this, the similar skills, but native languages in, in English, and I have nothing, native languages in Spanish. And for the reason, it's easy for them to support, to, to explore things. Also, one of the things um, we are analyzing with that is the anxiety of the users that, uh, that you can see because they started and they, they have some issues at the beginning, they, they are shy, but uh, later on they practice, practice and improve a lot. And this is one of the research we, we are uh, doing right now. And, and I say here it tends to decrease the learning practice and so on. Okay. How does it work? Uh, each week uh, we have some tasks to do. Uh, the, the tasks uh, are in a platform that name is Tandem that allows to connect two students to share or to do that task. Each task is in each languages. Then first, uh, at the beginning was in one in Spanish, then we practice Spanish, and then we change to the next task that is in English. Uh, the, we prepare materials and video tutorials. That materials and video tutorials are in Moodle, or part of uh, Moodle. Later on, I will explain a little bit of the architecture, more detail, but because we, we have uh, some ecosystem of application here interconnected. Then uh, the users can select. I want to, oh, I know you because uh, I did some tandems with you in the past, and I arrange a meeting with you. Oh, today at 11, 4, I will, I will be here, and I will invite to you to do a tandem. Then the other partner receives the invitation and access to the tandem, and they start the, ta the tasks. But also, I, I don't know, I can go like a roulette tandem. I start, I go there, and then I am waiting for uh, one person from the other languages to, to join to the conversation. There is an algorithm behind that if there is nobody available, because sometimes we have difficulties, because we have some users from the States, some users from uh, Spain, and then the, the time 
hours is quite difficult sometimes to find uh, uh, partners. Then if you don't have uh, partners, we do a, this special tandem between the same languages, but they have to do the task, and also all the tasks are recorded. And when the tasks are recorded, then uh, later on they can review that task, and also uh, they give us a self-assessment. Uh, today I feel comfortable, I, I feel that, and, some, and you evaluate your, yourself, and also evaluate the other side. Okay. Also, you, give, uh, you receive some points and budgets, and later on, you receive your certificate from the course. Let's review how it's currently the, the project. This is the website. The website is a WordPress that uh, the user can register, automatically uh, generates uh, a role to the course Moodle, the Moodle course. Uh, when the user access to the Moodle course, uh, they can see some tasks and uh, help them to re reflection about languages, practice. Uh, the, we, we give them some, some tasks to review some uh, aspects of each languages. And you as a student get some information. As a student, sorry, as an English student, you receive some information. And the user in Spanish receives other information. For the reason I, I made the, the question about the content, because we are using the filter, the current filter. Okay. Uh, the main tools are the roulette tandem. The you choose is when I can select with, I can connect with. Also, we have the, Victor, uh, the video recording and feedback. This uses by uh, using uh, open source uh, platform Big Blue Button. Uh, the user has their own portfolio that can review all the sessions with the, all the recording, review the feedback that has been received, and also review, ah, they, I, I always did that mistake that the other student told me, and I'll review, oh, yes, that's, that's right. Oh, I have a problem with that. Oh, uh, because sometimes there is interesting uh, chats because they start with the, probably with the task, but sometimes they continue and talk during more than one hour talking about other things. Uh, one of the aims of them is not only talk uh, where are you from, where you live, no. You put a task with some tasks to do, but later on, if you want to continue talking about do you want my children and so on, you can do it. Uh, also, we have a video forum using Moodle, uh, and in this case, the, the teacher or the facilitators of the course provide some information or some tasks to do, and the user has to respond, and we create like a conversation, but record it to review everything, adding some quiz activities, and gamification with ranks, points, and prices. Each week, uh, each week uh, we uh, renew the, the ranking, and uh, you have the winner for the week. The winner gets an extra class for, with uh, one of the teachers, and that helped them to, to fix some things, and it's an interesting way. And this is the task. In this case, we have four tasks. And you have one thing, the other part have another thing, probably, which are the difference between two images? And then you have to describe, I don't know. As I said, we have a blue button that has been integrated, and all it's auto-recorded. After each task, we have our thermometer anxiety, and you can see here, you can click, I'm very anxious or not. Then, when I finish, I give my self-assessment and the other, and I says my partner. Uh, I only see their assessment after I submit my, because I don't want to be manipulated about the answer of him, her. Uh, also here I have my portfolio with my badges I win, the time I, I spend with all the sessions and I can review. I, I, I'm the administrator, I can delete, the, the, the users can delete anything. Um, also, I get the ranking for each week that gives us, uh, with completing the first course questionnaire, it's integrated with Moodle, the, that tool that I will explain right now, 
but it's integrated with Moodle using LTI, the speaking time, when you complete all the activities, and so on. And let's go deep on the architecture. The architecture is based on WordPress. That, uh, that is our platform to register the user to show the information about the course. Okay. Then uh, Moodle as uh, a course when I have all the activities, all the users, and all the information about uh, some, uh, some resources that we provide to them. Also, we have Big Blue Button to record all the sessions. And Tandem, that is a custom development that has been, that you, you, you can uh, find one version here, open source launched, based on PHP. And here, more or less, is the schema. You have the landing registration. You go uh, to Moodle using one of the, our plugins that has been integrated, Moodle and, and WordPress. And then using LTI launch, uh, you access to the Tandem platform. And also, you get all the information about Tandem, ranking portfolio, so on. And integrated on Tandem, uh, we have Big Blue Button. And more or less, that I want to explain today for you. And if anyone has any question, sorry, I missed one slide that because I forgot to upload. But the URL of the site is mooc.speakups.org because in the, I uploaded yesterday, and I know. We can change it. Thanks. No, that was really good. Thank you. Thank you. OK, we do have time for some questions. If you'd like to raise your hand and then wait for a microphone to come to you. And uh, I'll let you stand by the microphone. And um, if you'd like to come up, is it Martin? Uh, if you'd like to come up and get your presentation ready. Any questions? I've got a question, but I'll, I'll wait until anyone else asks theirs first. Okay. Hi. Um, and you talked about uh, video recording, but you also said something about video forum. Yeah. How do you use that? Yeah. Uh, the video forum, we are using currently the forum, uh, the Moodle forum, using the, the options to record the, the video. Oh. The, we have. Uh, two, uh, with two minutes video, it's enough for the task we suggest to the, the users because it's a small task. But during the tandem task, you have probably one hour of video recording. For the reason we are using external tool like Big Blue Button to record that, and all the students uh, that has been participated in, the, in that conversation can review the video and review if they made some mistakes there or not. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Then, if it's not, join us, mooc.speakups.org. Thank you very much. Thank you.